We're out in the wilderness, also known as Macy's. In the racks. Spot clog. So Izzy, what are your thoughts on clogs? Um, I like clogs now than I did like 10, 15 years ago. Because they're a bit more streamlined. See, I had clogs 10 or 15 years ago, and I liked them then. And now, not that I, I don't like these. Sorry, Jessica Simpson. I'm very anti you. <laughs> Can't help it. Um, it's not personalized. I just don't like her brand. Anyway, um, yeah, I had clogs like I had clogs in 2006, and then I had them in high school, and I had them in college, and now I'm kind of like I've done the clogs. I mean, in high school, the girls kept tripping down the stairs, and they made them illegal in my high school. <laughs> you were illegal? Yeah. Was it so, like official school policy? Right. It became a policy. Many of the girls couldn't even walk. These are from Guess. They're 99 bucks. I like the hardware. The material's kind of crappy, though. I mean, clogs kind of look the same after a while. See, that's yes. that's old school clogs this from, is. from back in the day. Yeah, you've yeah, even got like the piece. <laughs> Unless you're rolling a doobie, I don't want to. Stores call this a clog. This to me is not really a clog, and I actually like this shoe and would wear it because it's got a lot of height to it, and I like height. I mean, clogs traditionally weren't supposed to have height. They're just supposed to be like low to the ground, comfortable, like Practical. doctors wear them. Well, I think to like revitalize well, them, they put them in Chanel a heel. Chanel did them, they did like this crazy heel with like a platform, and I also don't like the Chanel one, so I'm not just biased against just. Like the flossers, you're going to be like, kind of on purpose. Yeah. Uh, you shouldn't buy, you shouldn't wear your one dollar, um, what do you call it, old navy flip flops <laughs> to work, I'm sorry, like, it's really uncalled for. Plus they're bad for your feet, and your feet look dirty. Your feet look dirty when you walk in the street in flip-flops. Like, nobody wants to see your dirty big toe. Because, like, people who buy these and because they have stuff on them assume that they're fancy. This is not a fancy shoe. If you were 11, they'd work if you were 11 years old. <laughs> you do not wear these in a formal outfit. This not negate the fact that these are flip-flops. Because also you see the toe prints. You're going to see the toe prints, okay? It's just not a cute look. Now these are kind of like glazed. So these, this could be kind of cool. You know, you don't, you don't really see your, your gross toe jam impressed. So these are, I, I'm kind of into. These are cool, you know. I'm not totally against them, but it better be right. See, these have a cool leather trim. They have all this cool little detail, like the color, you can breathe. Those are really nice. These are much cooler. The peanut gallery is totally Do you like these? Likes these? Yeah. You don't spend money on Javianas. They're basic flip flops. In Brazil, these are like a dollar. Why they are you really paying $25 are. for this? They're they really freaking are. flip flops. Old Navy. We're very passionate. But I just want to say we're also kind of fickle because look what I have on my feet. I have on flip flops. Behold the wall of mandals. Izzy, how do you feel about these? <laughs> that would be no. <laughs> you, you, know mean, you don't like these? The problem is men have big clunky feet and you know, there's hair on them sometimes, men don't really manicure their toes that well, so you really shouldn't be rocking them like that unless, you know, you take a little more care on the presentation. Or at the beach, at the beach you can wear flip flops. Now these I kind of like, I will say, only because you see how it's kind of like this nice sort of curve, or even these other common clients. They're kind of like a nice shape, so your feet don't look so, you know, Neanderthal-esque. And you should also not be wearing these with dress pants, because that's just not a good look. Nor is the Frat Boy Special, usually worn with white tube socks. No. If you ever want to meet or date a girl, or a guy, I just think they're wrong across all levels if you're trying to attract some sort of life partner. I mean, these I wouldn't. I'm not really offended by. If I'm on vacation with some like linen shorts, you know, something cash. I'm not totally against it, but just the feet have to look good. That's really the rule number one. With all of this kind of like, I hang out in the forest. I'm not into. But I hang out in the forest. <laughs> well, you have on flip flops too. <laughs> no, we're just browsing. Thank you. <laughs> So obviously, you maybe shouldn't take my advice. <laughs> Our last footwear issue is the ubiquitous tights and socks. Or, excuse me, not tights and socks. Tight socks and sandals. <laughs> is that the 
I think they didn't even catch that. Like when did you go to school? I mean, if you're doing, if you're trying to be sort of funky, I don't have a problem with it. But you know, just bring the look. Don't just wear a good one else wearing it. That's always my opinion on most, you know, trend pushing things. I concur. I mean, I think it's an interesting look. I think it's. God, I hate saying this because it makes me sound so old, but I think it's better on younger people and like older people. I just haven't seen someone over the age of 25 convincingly rock this look. Actually, I haven't really seen anyone rock this look in a way that makes me think, oh wow, she looks really adult and sophisticated. It doesn't make it a bad look, I just haven't seen it. I mean, the older you get, the more sophisticated you should be getting, ideally. Not even should, even if you want to be trendy, yeah. you can still class it up, so. But men shouldn't be doing that. Even me, I wouldn't pull that off. The men have hair on their legs, the socks pushing the hair over. It's just not it's really graceful great. and clean and smooth, you know. Unless you're waxing, which I've done, and that's fine. But then, it sort of doesn't work. So, that's what we think. Of course, next season, we could totally be endorsing this look and saying, go out and buy socks and wear them. So, too. we're going to keep shopping, but uh, what we've learned today is... Flip-flops are bad, even when you're wearing them on your feet now. Manicure your feet if you're gonna do it. Yeah. Um, and look for alternatives. Mandals don't work on anyone. No man, no mandals. If I find a pair, I'll show you shoes. Keep it casual. Tights with shoes. If you're on the young side, or if you can find a way to pull them off and still look like you're an adult. And uh, that's it. Time to yeah. drink.